Topping our news at 6, Murphy Oil Corporation will be closing its office headquarters in El Dorado, and many are wondering what's next for the town. NBC 10's Gabrielle Pfeiffer spoke with city leaders who will remain optimistic about their future. The Murphy Oil Corporation has been a staple in El Dorado for decades. It's no secret of their commitment to the community. They've always given back to the community, you know, and not just as far as education is concerned. It's not like they were just here and, and didn't have a presence. So they, they've always been very supportive. Oil prices layered on top of the COVID-19 pandemic forced executives to make a decision that many didn't see coming. Although we hate to see anyone leave, I think we have to be very optimistic even about that. Although it's bad news, the mayor says it's not a complete loss. And Murphy USA will stay and the Eldorado Promise. The Chamber of Commerce has been working to bring corporations and businesses to Eldorado. It may not replace Murphy Oil, but it will bring some hope back into the town. We're just waiting for the official announcement from that corporation, and uh, that's going to bring positive news to El Dorado. And as far as the future of this oil town... And this is just one bump in the road, but uh, El Dorado will, will continue, to, I think, to, to, uh, to grow and prosper. Luther says two retail stores and a family entertainment business have already begun making renovations to buildings in El Dorado. While the consolidation decision for Murphy Oil is a blow, it's certainly not the end. In El Dorado, Gabrielle Pfeiffer, NBC10, your local news leader. A spokesperson for the Murphy Oil Corporation said they're working with the 82 employees who have been affected by the closure. They expect officially closing down sometime in July.